Once there was a girl named Mary. First, um, an angel came. An angel. The angel's name was Gabriel. At first, Mary was scared. Mary was afraid of the angel. The angel. Um, an angel came and was like, Mary, you're gonna have a baby. God says so. Don't be afraid. She felt scared because she never had a baby before. Oh no, she wasn't married. Uh oh. She was nervous. Oh, uh, scared. The angel came down and told Joseph too. And told Joseph in a dream. And the boys didn't want to marry um, Mary. I thought he was scared. Pretty surprised. No less. Joseph wanted to divorce her, but the angel said no because it's God's baby. The king ordered that Joseph was from Bethlehem, and that was his hometown. So he went to a town called Bethlehem on a camel with donkeys. They drive the all the way. No, they walked. They ride on the donkey. He might have felt a little bit nauseous. She goes to a barn because there is no room in the inn because all of the places were closed and stuff. Because they couldn't find anywhere else to stay. Because there were no other houses left. No hospital. There was no room. But one of the inns had a stable. There was a farm house. Oh yeah, they went to a farm. That. And that's where Jesus was born. And there would be no doctors. To get the baby out of the belly. Baby Jesus was born. The baby was just laying down. Uh, with soft stuff, kind of. Bible thing. And Mary was holding Jesus. Walk him. Then he was wrapped up in cloth and he had... Because he's a baby. And um, wrapped him up in the um, pig slot thingy. Probably I'd be scared if I was a baby in that. I'm sleepy. <laughs> he probably would have felt kind of awkward. Um, Comfortable. It was embarrassing. It's very odd. It would probably been crazy and loud, noisy, smelly. It would be stinky because of all the animals. There will be a lot of animals watching. There were sheep, cows, chickens, goats. Sheep, cow, donkey, bull, sheep. We have a little lamb, little lamb, little lamb. Cows, chickens, sheep. Oh, there is baby God. The shepherds were just standing around. So the angels came down to the shepherds and did a dance and told them that there was a baby. The angel told them. The angel there was lots of angels. The angel said that there was a new baby getting born. It's about baby Jesus. The angel came and said, Oh, look at the box. No, there's stuff there for you. Stand in the corner. They have like this white dress and some rings. Um, that thing on their head, the ring. But I got into a fairy. They were singing. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. So the shepherds walk to Bethlehem to see baby Jesus. As an angel. The shepherds 
named Noah. Uh, he uh, lead his people out of uh, Egypt. No. No. And King Herod is trying to kill him because he's a king. There was three kings followed the star to the barn to see baby Jesus. King! One of them was named Casper. The wise men found the, the star and the Bethlehem stall. Little, little, little dog, how I love to watch you all. And I was like, I want to follow this big star. I want to see where it will lead me. They were like, oh, there must be a baby that's going to be a savior. A baby was born that, that was going to be special. And what up to Jesus? It was bright. They gave presents to the baby. So one of the kings brought um frankincense. Um, sober. The presents. Gold, basically. A BB toy. Gems. Gold and copper and silver and flashlights. And a golden box. A wine bottle. Um, like a chest thing. And I can't remember the third one. The last one I think he bought like a bottle. I remember one time I dropped the wine bottle. And then we had to use a fake one. Frankincense, gold, and meh. One, two, three, a giant box of cereal. Oh, and that's it. And set it in the story. Everybody was looking at the baby and they were all excited. Um, so we can see what he looks like. The play for Jesus. They're probably happy and excited. Probably praising the Lord. The baby was leaping in joy and everyone else also. <laughs> excited because there's a new king born. He's special. He protects us. Yes. He takes care of us. Baby Jesus is God. And he saved the world from sin. He loves everybody. He's powerful. He died on me, it I know. No, the Bible, the Jesus' birthday. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. I love coming to church because we can learn about God. Sunday school. I can hear God's word. Because you pray. I see my friend Rachel. It's fancy. And mommy sings. Making crafts. And we go up to communion. We drink wine. That we do lots of events. Um, like fall festival and that kind of stuff. Actually, I like that there's a big gigantic cross outside. What I love about our church is that my dad is playing music and we have church parties and we um, have donuts to eat. We learn about God. I love our church because uh, that um, we get donuts. Only when we go in the place where we grow up, Lord. I'm doing the crafts. I love coming to church because they teach us about Jesus. Well, tell us about God. I like about the church is I have a lot of friends here and it's learning about God. Eat that, eat that, Merry Christmas!